Hello and welcome to this tutorial about the RGB array. In this tutorial I'm going to explain how to use the RGB array as a simulation of traffic lights. What do you need to follow this tutorial? You need the RGB array of course, a TI Innovator Hub and a TI Inspire or a laptop with the software on it. For doing that you need to attach the RGB array to the Innovator Hub. You can do that with the attached wire. The red wire needs to be connected with 5 volt. The blue wire with BB5, the yellow wire with BB2 and the black wire with ground. If done that you can start writing the software. We make software for a intersection light and for a walk don't walk light. Let's start with the walk don't walk light. I've made a 3D printed cover for the RGB array for that. It's quite simple, you want to uh, have a red light strip at the don't walk and a green light strip at the walk. That's why uh, it's nice that there are two rows RGBs with the RGB array. So the first row needs to be red and the second row needs to be green. To do that we have a simple program, you see it here. Uh, define RGB program, uh, start the programming and then send connect RGB. That's necessary because the RGB array is an uh, external device so you need to send connect. Then uh, wait, it's not necessary but it's to give some time to start the program. And then a loop that hits, uh, runs 10 times and 1 to 10 that's for having uh, not a continuous loop but more than one times walk, don't walk. Then the for loop from uh, 0 to 7, so uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, is for the first row to uh, drive the LEDs on. So there stands set RGB I well I, this is the value of I, 25500, zero, zero, so set the LEDs one at a time on red, and I plus 8, so 8 to 15, on zero so set the LEDs off. So the first row is in uh, the red color and the second row is off so the don't walk sign is on. Then after two seconds there is another for loop. You see it on the screen. The for loop from 8 to 15. You can recycle I because the for loop is executed so you may use I again. Set RGB 0 to 550, so let 8 to 15 are turning on green, one let at a time. And set RGB I minus 8, 0, 0, so turn all the first seven LEDs off. You turn every LED on uh, separately, but uh, we don't see that because there is no wait instruction between that, so the execution time is very low. If you film it with a high, high, high speed camera, you should see it that it's one LED at a time, but our eyes don't see that. And then the usual end for end programming and that's it. So it's a quite simple programming to test out the RGB array for the very first time. The second RGB programming is intersection lights. It's quite handy that the RGB array has 16 lights on it. You see it here at the uh, drawing of the intersection. You have O2, that's the four LEDs at the left upper corner. O4 is the four LEDs on the left lower corner. O1 is the four LEDs on the right upper corner. And O3 are the four LEDs on the right lower corner. That's also the place on the RGB array. Uh, in this programming I don't use the arrows. The programming is here also quite simple. You have first uh, back to connect RGB and then you have an outer loop 1 and 2 and an inner loop 0 to 5. In the inner loop first every uh, four lights on the intersection is are red. By the first there are uh, one uh, direction that gets the green light by two the same direction gets the orange light after a wait period 
by three the same uh, street are getting the red light by four the green light for um, for the other street is going on uh, by uh, is5 the orange light for that street is going on and then uh, all the red lights are going back on etc 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 then the for loop is ended and then the programming is ended with all lights off so you see it that's not so uh, difficult it's a little bit running into a for loop so it's a nice uh, exercise for students to getting know how what the for loop does and a little bit logical thinking computational thinking from what needs to be happened when needs one light be red, the other lights green and the other lights orange.